Hi guys, welcome to Tech Trick Tutorial. Today we're going to talk about how to create an online course step by step. It's a step by step guide to follow easily, so don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Let's dive right in. Now in today's video, we will be utilizing udemy.com to create our online course. We will be using this platform as you can see because this platform is a platform where you can buy different courses and study in it as you can see here on our screen. Now aside from buying courses here and learning from them, you could also create your own online course yourself and the process is very easy. Now as you can see also over here on the navigation bar, you will be able to see all the different categories that you could create and view different courses on. So when we create our online course later, you will be able to see these options as well as part of the category depending on what type of online course are you going to create. Now, when you first log in to oudemy.com, you wouldn't really know how to start. You wouldn't know where you will be able to create a course. That's very simple. All you need to do is to select this course instructor option over here or simply instructor over here and simply click this and you will be redirected to another page where you will be able to start and create your own courses as you can see here below. Of course, there's also information over here but we're going to dismiss this for now so that we aren't too confused. But as you can see, this is where you will be able to create your new online courses. I already have some drafts over here so I know that you will be able to create a course in this section. So to start with, you simply go to click on new course over here on the right side and you will be able to begin the process of creating your course now before we start there's a four step introduction and over here it's going to ask us what type of course are we making we could either create a course which is basically for learning where you could have video lectures quizzes coding and exercises but for the practice test also you could have this to help students prepare for certification exams so of course since we're online course we will select this option over here, the course, and let's proceed with the next step by simply clicking on continue. And over here, you simply go to put in your working title. Of course, depending on the title or the topic that you're going to create your online course, it will vary. And so if you already have a good title, you can simply type it here. But for us, we don't have any title yet. So let's say temporary title. Here we go. You will be able to change your title later on, so don't worry about the title that you're going to put. But if you already have a good and academic title, you could simply put it over here. After that, you simply go going to click on continue. And now this is what I was talking about earlier. You're going to select the category of your course, as you can see here. And also, same thing with the title. You will be able to change this later on if you're not sure about the category just yet. So for us, let's say our course will be about coding. So let's select our category. Now for coding, of course, the course will be about IT and software. So simply select this option. And of course, depending on your theme or your topic, you can select the corresponding category over here. Selecting the correct category will allow your different users of Udemy to be able to find your course if they're looking for a specific course, especially if it's about the course that you're offering. So after that, just simply go to click on continue. And over here, how much time can you spend creating your course per week? So you can simply choose the corresponding answers depending on your availability. There is no wrong answers and they will be able to help you achieve your goals even if you don't have much time. So let's say I'm very busy right now. So zero to two hours and simply click on create course. And after that, we will now be able to proceed to the creation of our course as you can see over here on the left side as you can see we have all of the step the first step is for the intended learners then the course structure and setup and test video after that you will be able to create your content over here like film and edit your curriculum captions it is optional and accessibility and then you can simply publish your course over here by entering a course landing page pricing and course messages over here. Those are the steps on how to create your online course in Udemy. Now the first step is the intended learners. As it, the title suggests, you're going to put in information that is directly for your intended learners. Like for example over here, what will your students learn in this course? You can simply put them over here. Since our topic is coding, we could say 
the user will be able to learn the skill to code java or whatever coding language we are using and over here you could add at least three more because the minimum is four learning objectives or outcome so you can simply put them over here and you could also delete them over here by simply clicking on delete and you can move them around as well and over here there's also a requirement or prerequisite for taking our course you could say the student must know the basics of java something like that but of course since our course is a beginner we could just settle it with no programming experience needed as you can see you will learn everything you need to know this is a suggested example and over here who is this course for we could say beginner programmers for java something like that and after that you could go to the next step which is course structure but before you go of course save your progress but we would need to complete this so let's simply copy paste this for now there you go and let's go to save this and let's go to the next step on the next step we have your course structure as you can see there's information over here planning your course carefully will create a clear learning path for students and help you once you fill. so basically in this section uh you will be able to see the requirements and different information that you need for your course everything you need to know about the structure like the outline the introduction the sections that you will need to put the lectures all of those information so you can simply read through this and you will be able to see also the library of resources over here which would allow you to build your course structure and after that there's also setup and test video over here and you will be able to set up like a video about you and introduction about the course and you will need to put a test video over here so that your uh, video will have some critic or your introduction will be examined by experts and give them or give you personalized advice for your audio and video but of course this depends on your course and for me i think the course which is coding it will be different there wouldn't be really a video but as you can see there's a video required over here anyway after that you can now check out the film and editing this is where you could edit your video then over here your curriculum this is where you could build them you could put in your lectures your curriculum item like lecture quiz coding exercise and assignment over here you could add the content over here you could either upload a video upload a video and slide mashup and you could also upload an article over here and you can simply build your output over here as you can see uh lecture one is introduction lecture two is beginning codes i guess and you can simply add lecture and this will be the lecture two then you could add the content as well same thing with lecture one then you could add like a quiz over here how to code something like that then you can simply build your course in this section after that you now have your captions over here your course landing page you could put them over here all this information that you need to put and you also have your pricing over here you have the option to have it as free or have this pricing over here of course and after completing all of this information of course the information that you will put depends on your course topic but after completing all of this checklist you will then be able to submit for review and if your course passes the review you will be able to upload it to udemy and have your online course started and that's basically it that is how you will be able to create an online course step by step hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching